The Texas Department of Transportation warned El Paso today, prepare for more construction projects on the city's west side. In addition to the GO-10 project at Executive Center and the Border West Expressway project at Paisano, Texas plans on working on an underpass at Trans Mountain and a frontage road between the Montecito Development and I-10. All four projects will be taking place over the next four years. And you can expect it to get worse. And, and TxDOT district engineer Bob is Bielek is talking about traffic on El Paso's west side. The GO-10 project is adding a lane and collector distributor roads from Executive to Mesa. Its detour route using Paisano is also under construction in the beginning stages of the Border West Expressway. Both have to be worked on at the same time due to the timing of funding and because they're connected. At the end of next year, when engineers are actually connecting the two projects, expect the worst. That will be the most difficult phase of this project. Made even more difficult by a large development being built behind Montecito and next to I-10 at Executive. TxDOT is using the developer's extra dirt fill as foundation for its new frontage road. During this time, using Trans Mountain as a way around it is suggested but that, too, will be down the lane. There's just no way to avoid doing them at the same time. TxDOT recommends leaving early or later to avoid adding to the rush hour mess. For help, go to the GO10 El Paso website. It's a central location to find out everything that's happening on I-10 between Executive Center and North Mesa, including tweets, maps, and traffic alerts. Starting next year, TxDOT will have a smartphone app that offers alternative routes and alerts. I will be getting that app.